Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. We compile the latest tech and automobile news or videos are guaranteed to keep you coming back for more exciting content, so make sure to like, comment and subscribe to the channel so you are always up to date with our latest videos as soon as they're uploaded. A cheaper version of the C40 Recharge Electric Coupe SUV is now available to order now direct from Volvo. The Volvo C40 Recharge is now available to order directly through the brand's online store. The entry-level, single-motor model is priced at £44,800 outright, or £589 a month on an all-inclusive subscription package that bundles servicing, maintenance, wear and tear cover and road tax. The brand's second pure electric model is effectively a coupe SUV variant of the more conventionally shaped XC40 Recharge, but unlike that car, it doesn't have petrol, diesel, or plug-in hybrid sister models, instead being electric only. Outside, the C40 bears some similarities to the XC40, but there's also a lower roofline, a reworked taillight design and a new face up front, with headlights that incorporate Pixel technology. It's only available to order online, but Volvo has simplified the order process by offering just three trim levels, core, only available on the single motor variant, plus an ultimate. The C40's rivals include the Tesla Model Y, Audi Q4 Sportback e-tron, Volkswagen ID.5 and Ford Mustang Mach-E. The C40 Recharge has two drivetrain options to choose from, a single-motor variant with a 69kWh battery and a twin-motor model with a 78kWh battery. Like all Volvos these days, the C40 is limited to a top speed of 112 miles per hour for safety reasons. The entry-level model has an expected range of 269 miles, while the twin-motor variant can achieve between 273 and 286 miles depending on trim level. However, with both models able to receive over-the-air OTA, software updates, these figures could be improved even after customers take delivery of their cars. At the car's maximum charging speed of 150 kilowatts, the battery of the single-motor C40 can be replenished from 10 to 80 percent capacity in 32 minutes. Inside, a range of colors and material finishes can be selected according to buyer's tastes, although for the first time on a Volvo, leather isn't offered as a seat trim option. There are three trim levels on offer, core, plus and range topping ultimate. On the practicality front, an identical wheelbase to the XC40 sees the C40 promise the same rear legroom as its stablemate, although in common with other coupe SUVs, there's a reduction in headroom due to the sloping roofline. The C40 also has the same 413-liter rear and 31-liter front boots as the electric XC40. As with the XC40 and models from Volvo spin-off brand Polestar, the C40's infotainment system will be based on the Android phone and tablet operating system, giving drivers access to Google functions such as Maps, Assistant and the Play Store. Following on from the C40, Volvo plans to launch additional pure electric models from 2025 to 2030. It's anticipating that 50% of its global sales will be pure electric by 2025, with this proportion rising to 100% by 2030, at which point the UK's ban on sales of purely petrol and diesel engine cars comes into effect. Friends, what do you think about the new Volvo C40 Recharge Electric? I will wait for your opinion in the comments as well as put likes and subscribe to the channel so as not to miss the latest news from the world of cars.